Lake County has two public monuments to the American Civil War, and women sculptors had a role in the design of each. Though no battles were fought here, Lake County gave significant support to the war effort, sending nearly 2,000 men to fight to preserve the Union and ultimately to abolish slavery. Communities rallied around the soldiers, and women coordinated donations of quilts and bandages and advocated for better care of the sick and wounded. After the war ended in 1865, a Soldiers' Monument Association was formed to commemorate the war dead. It would take 34 years to raise enough money to build a monument. Edith Freeman was selected to create four bronze panels for the base of the monument. Panels depicted the county's troops in the infantry, artillery, cavalry, and navy. Freeman was a talented sculptor and graduate of the School of the Art Institute in Chicago. Her grandfather, Addison Partridge, and uncle, Charles Partridge, served in the Civil War with the 96th Illinois Volunteer Infantry, and her father, Isaac Freeman, served in the Vermont Cavalry. The 55-foot-tall granite Soldiers and Sailors Monument with Freeman's bronze panels affixed to the base was dedicated in the Courthouse Square in Waukegan on August 29, 1899. Nearly 70 years later, the county commissioned a statue to be placed on the west side of the courthouse to commemorate Abraham Lincoln's visit to Waukegan in 1860 and his leadership during the Civil War. In 1968, sculptor Carl Topo of Barrington Hills was hired to create one of his famous Lincoln statues. The bust of Abraham Lincoln was completed and set on a granite pedestal, but the bas-relief friezes that were planned, depicting Lincoln's visit and the Civil War, could not be added due to a lack of funds. In 1995, the county revived the Lincoln Monument project and reached out to Lily Topo to complete her late husband's work. Lily Mark Topo was an accomplished Lincoln sculptor and artist in her own right and had previously created a hanging sculpture for the county's courthouse. Lily was a graduate of the Chicago Academy of Fine Arts where she was a student of American sculptor Laredo Taft. Lily Topo approached the Lincoln Project with an eye to putting her own mark on the monument. Utilizing her husband's concepts for the bronze friezes, she rendered them in her own style that captured lifelike reality and action. Nearly 100 years separated the work of Edith Freeman and Lily Topo on the monuments. Both women were talented sculptors and uniquely qualified to lend their artistry in commemorating Lake County's role in the Civil War. On your next visit to Waukegan, take a stroll around the courthouse to view the impressive monuments and the work of these artists in person.